Hello, it's me, Kimberly. I'm back with another review. This one is the Lyra Far Bryson Color Giant Skin Tones 12 Count. Um, I picked these up at the same art store as the Brunzeal Design Colored Pencils. Um, they had two different packs. They had this one and another one with people on it. I didn't look at that one carefully. If I looked at it, I think it was supposed to be the 12 or 14 pencils. I'm not sure. But <clears throat> I picked these up because I wanted to see them to see how well they lay down for skin tone, color complexion, things like that. Uh, these have a 6.25 millimeter. I believe they're wax based. I'm not too sure. I've tried looking online for information. So if anyone can find it, I would greatly appreciate it. So let's get started. As you can tell, it's a really humongous pencil. There's the core in it. Well, I like the way it lays down. If you don't put too much pressure on it, it'll actually lay down pretty good, actually. Not too heavy, not too dark. Just the right amount of pressure is needed only. So I think that's the problem that a lot of people had with these, that they were probably pushing down too hard on it to get the color to come out on the paper. I guess being left-handed in some ways, or at least angling it like this, it's better. I wouldn't say they're perfect, but for mixing with other skin tone colors, I would say these could get the job done if you get the point sharp enough to do it. I don't see why you couldn't do it. Unfortunately, there's no names and no numbers on them to give you an idea of which pencil it is, but you can form your own opinion on them if you have them or if you're thinking about them, if you're looking into buying colored pencils with skin toned, this could be a good set. I know Crayola I think has one, but I haven't really tried theirs because I'm not really a complete fan of Crayola because, I don't know, since they changed the formula for their pencils from way back when I was a kid, they're not the same pencils anymore. This is more like a burnt sienna for me. So at least I recognize one color. This is like a umber, I would say. In a lot of ways, it feels like I'm doing a foundation color chart instead <laughs> for makeup. This would be like a dark umber, perhaps, or sepia almost. I would definitely recommend sharpening them to get a better point because this comes with a blunt point really really blunt if you look and you see right there it's blunt not pointed and this is the last color so overall it is a nice set actually I enjoy them I'm going to be using these definitely for when I color skin tones. Probably mix them in with um, some of my other color pencil sets that I have. So I will be looking forward to using these better. I would say definitely invest in a set, but that's just my opinion. I do apologize that 
where there are no numbers listed on this box but this is what the box looks like for one set and I like them okay so have a good night bye